Hi everybody, I'm Patrick Novotny, I'm the tie guy, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie not known to man, and I'm bringing that to you. So if that's the kind of thing you're looking for, then please subscribe. Alright, this time I've got an invention, again, another one from Anatoly Zigarov, and his invention is called the Rosebud Knot. So let me show you how to do that Rosebud Knot right now. Okay, so it's tied with the little end, it's on this side, it's the long end, and then the big end is over here, it is and the bottom of my big end is just a little bit above my belt line. All right, so starting off, we're going to dimple our big end, bring it to the middle, take the little end, cross over. Take the little end, feed it up through the back of your necktie, and across. So we're gonna be tying this necktie knot uh, quite loose, not too loose that it you know starts falling on you, uh, but keeping it loose so it sort of stays open and flowery, right? All right, so taking this little end, we're going to cross it around the back, like so, feed it up through the top of your necktie, and back down and across. So I just want to keep it just loose enough, so nothing's tight there. Taking this little end, we want to make it crossing over the, the higher end. I'm holding it up with my thumb here. I want it to be a little bit on the high side as I bring it across and I feed it up through the back of our necktie knot here. I don't want it falling down. So this is the part where I, I tend to tighten this part up a little bit because I want to keep this a little on the high side. All right, so it's not going to be perfectly tight, but I just want it to stay up there. All right, taking the little end now, crossing over, feeding it back in behind and around, and this is it, we're almost done. We'll feed the top end down through our neck hole again, and we're going to tuck it in behind our uh, collar here. So it's not as tight as, it, or it's a little loose for me at this moment. Um, so you can just put your fingers in there. I'm pulling down this end a little bit and I wouldn't mind actually tightening this part up just a tiny bit more. And now I can bring that across again and tuck that into my collar, like so. So holding on to your knot, pulling down on the big end, cinch it up. There we go, there's the rosebud knot. That is how the Rosebud Knot is done. Thank you very much, Anatoly, for uh, sharing that with me and putting a video out there that I could learn from. If you want to see the original video, you have to go check out Anatoly Zigarov's YouTube channel. And thank you so much for sending that to me. And if you want to post or share your Rosebud Knots with me on Instagram, just make sure to tag me or you can post that on my Facebook page as well. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned. I've got so many more coming for you. Thanks.